Dubai is thought to have been established as a fishing village in the early 18th century 30, and was, by 1822, a town of some 700 to 800 members of the Bani Yas tribe and subject to the rule of Sheikh Ta. In 1901, Maktoum bin Hashir al Maktoum established Dubai as a free port with no taxation on imports or exports, and also gave merchants parcels of land and guarantees of protection and tolerance. These policies saw a movement of merchants not only directly from Linga, 35, but also those who had settled in Ras al Khaimah and Sharjah. The frequency of these vessels only helped to accelerate Dubai's role as an emerging port and trading hub of preference. Dubai's geographical proximity to Iran made it an important trade location. The town of Dubai was an important port of call for foreign tradesmen, chiefly those from Iran, many of whom eventually settled in the town. By the beginning of the 20th century, it was an important port. Dubai was known for its pearl exports until the 1930s. The pearl trade was damaged irreparably by the 1929 Great Depression and the innovation of cultured pearls. With the collapse of the pearling industry, Dubai fell into a deep depression and many residents lived in poverty or migrated to other parts of the Persian Gulf. In 1937, an oil exploration contract was signed which guaranteed royalty rights for Dubai and concessionary payments to Sheikh Saeed bin Maktoum. However, due to World War II, oil would not be struck. Despite a lack of oil, Dubai's ruler from 1958, Sheikh Rashid bin Said Al Maktoum, used revenue from trading activities to build infrastructure. Private companies were established to build and operate infrastructure, including electricity, telephone services, and both the ports and airport operators. An airport of sorts, a runway built on salt flats, was established in Dubai in the 1950s, and in 1959, the Emirates' first hotel, the Airlines Hotel, was constructed. This was followed by the Ambassador and Carlton Hotels in 1968. Dubai had already embarked on a period of infrastructural development and expansion. Oil revenue flowing from 1969 onwards supported a period of growth, with Sheikh Rashid embarking on a policy of building infrastructure and a diversified trading economy before the Emirates' limited reserves were depleted. Oil accounted for 24% of GDP in 1990, but had fallen to 7% of GDP by 2004. Rest is history with the booming airports, hotels, buildings like Burj Khalifa Dubai attracted tourism from all over the world and became one of most visited city of the world. After the death of Sheikh Rashid, it was all done under the rule of His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum.